Hi everyone, good morning and welcome to the New York Times Hard Sudoku. This, today is Sunday, February the 25th, and we'll see how easier this one is or not. I look and see 8 and 2 and 1 in the top three rows. Those two 8s will force an 8 in row 2, but this is ruled out because of that 8, so 8 is placed in box 3. Those two 1s are going to force a 1 in the bottom of box 1, but not here, so 1 is placed there. Those twos are going to force a two, actually one of these two. Can't go there because of this one. In the middle three rows, uh, they gave me all the nines. How generous of them. If we assume nine's not there, I've got one each of five, four, two, one, eight, seven, three. I think we're done. Yep. The bottom three rows, I have no repeats. Yes, I did transpose the grid correctly. There is, in fact, nothing in box 7. Now, if we look vertically, these ones are going to force a 1 there. <sighs> That's all I get. Uh, 9 is here someplace. 8, 1, 2, 6, 9, 6, 7, 4. That's it. What about the rightmost rows? Uh, threes are there. I just did eight. If three and eight aren't there, I get one, two, four, nine, seven points apiece. Okay, that's it. All right, I'm going to have to start looking at crossings and some other pointings or what have you. is in fact there. I mean, the, the, it did say this solved uniquely, but I'm trying to figure out how. Okay, one, two, seven, eight, nine. I need three, four, five, and six for the remainder of row five. can't be 4, and this can't be 4 because of the box. Oh, I forgot to put this one in as 3, 4, 6. Okay, uh, 1, 2, 3, 7, 8 in column 8. It says I need 4, 5, 6, and 9. I think that's any of them. This is oh, this sees 4, 5, and 9. That is a 6. It's placed. Three, not three, not three or five. Okay, that's not six. Okay, so I'm left with four, five, and nine. This has to be four or five only. It can't be six. This is five or nine. Okay, there's a pair here, one and two. Box six, neither of which are resolved, but that's going to give me five digits in the row. No, four digits in the row. One, two, three, nine. I need four, five, six, seven, eight. Neither of those can be five. Clean this up. Clean this up. Well, that can be any of them, which is irritating. Well, that doesn't give me any triples or anything else, does it? There's one. Yeah, I'll have to work in the middle of the grid first. This 2 and this virtual 2 will force a 2 in one of these, but not here. I did not mean to put it there. I can corner mark those 2s. Oh, and 1. Because this is a 2, 1, this is a 2, 1. And 1 and 2 are both ruled out at this cell. So, these, so this is a 1, 2 hidden pair. Because 1's also forced into one of those 2 cells only. 
okay, which means this is going to be 4, 5, 6, 7, or 8, except it sees 4, 5, and 6. So this is down to 7 or 8. I've got 1, 2, 4, 5, 6, 9. Okay, that means 3 is over there. And these two are 3, 7, 8. four and too many spots here. I can't do any work on box four. That's a shame. Ah, but the middle third is done. I need to work on some other rows. Okay, what about column nine? I've got three, five, eight, nine place. I need one, two, four, six, seven. These two are four of the digits, but not five of them. Okay, this is four, six, seven. It sees one and two. Oh, that also sees one and two. These are two thirds of four, six, seven, but I don't know anything else. One, two, three, eight. Okay, these are going to be from four, five, six, seven, nine. That'll complete the box. Okay, that's not helpful. Down here, the one, two, five, six, seven, nine are still open. Is there any crossing or something else? Sort of looking at restricted cells like all of these, which are not one, five, or nine to start with. This is two, three, eight in a row. That's seven in the box. Both of those see seven, eight in the box. This is two in a row. Okay, these are not one, five, nine. Sort of six. This one can also be three, seven, eight. Yeah, I put that pesky three in there. If those threes weren't there, I'd have like two, four, six triples or a pair or something, and I'd be able to place three of those digits, but I can't quite do that. Fiddlesticks. But, looking at box 8, I have 6, 9, 7, 4 already placed. I need 1, 2, 3, 5, 8. Well, none of these can be 1 or 2 because 1 and 2 look down. So, 1, 2 is a hidden pair right there. That means this is a 3, 5, 8, and this is 3 and 8, so that's a 5. And these are 3, 8, I'm just going to make this one 7. seven because this can't be eight. No, this is not seven. That's not five or seven. No, that can't be eight because three and eight go here. This is going to be the other four six half that goes with that one. And I'm glad I found the one two hidden pair, but I don't like that it's offset like that. Oh, what that does give me is a 1-2 pair in columns 4 and 5. Okay, so I've got 1, 2, 7, 9, I need 4. I have 1, 2, 7, 8, 9 in column 5. So 3, 4, 5, 6, one of those can't be 3. This can't be 3, so that 3 is placed. This is from 4, 5, 6, and that's going to be a triple that I'm going to resolve relatively easily. In column 4, I now have 1, 2, 
three, four, six. So I need five, seven, eight, nine. Well, eight's placed. And none of these can be eight. So the, these three are five, seven, nine. Which has the effect of that's not seven, and most importantly, that's not five. Okay, four, six pair here, but four, six pair in the column also. So five is placed. I can't do anything else with that. Poop. But four, six pair here. Because this can't be four, six in column three. That's not four. This is actually placed as a two. It's the only thing it can be. Not two, not six, not two. Uh, this is a two because that can't be. That's a three. These are three, but this two in row eight is going to do a lot of damage. Are all my one twos going to resolve? I think they will. Okay, that's not two. Importantly, that's not one. Okay, the, the, these two are a pair. These are five and nine. Box one is complete. Hmm. Let's see. I haven't done much work on the rightmost third of the grid, have I? But the left third I can do some work with. Particularly column one. I've got one, two, seven, eight placed. I need three, four, five, six, nine. Here. And here. Two, three, seven, eight placed. I need one, four, five, six, nine. There. These aren't six or nine. Either of those are five. That's not three by row. That's not one. Either of those are four, but everything is filled in. here, which is already marked. Nine has too many spots waiting for it. Um, let's see, five, nine there means this, this is six. Okay, so these aren't six. That's a four, seven pair. Oh, this is a one, two, so that resolves that six. So nine, five, four, Okay, this sees everything but seven. No. This can't be five, six, or nine. That's one or seven. But four or five makes this a nine, and column eight is complete. Um, okay, I've got a four, seven there, which rolls out seven from here, and six and nine. That's a five. That's going to do any work on the, this third of the grid. Six in row two makes that four, six. Okay, this is nine to complete the row. That's seven, which makes this five. That's four, six. Seven in row one sorts out the four, seven. The four in column five sorts out the six, four offset. It comes over here and sorts out the six, four in box four. Okay. One in row seven, so it's out two, one, two, seven, one, nine, six, four, three, five. Oh, I get a three in the corner, a party for it. Seven, eight, three, and there we go.
14 and a half minutes. Not too shabby. Especially for a box which had nothing filled in. Once I saw all the hidden pairs, it was relatively easily done. I may have done this in 12 or 11, but I'm happy with a time under 15 minutes. How about the rest of you?